Hi everybody and welcome to QAC TV Live. I'm here as always with Bruce and we're here to run down some events for you guys that happened last week and that are coming up this week. As always, we're live, so leave your comments, your likes, and your shares. We'd love to hear from you guys. That's right. I'm on the computing machine right now. So if you have any questions or you want to tell us about events that are coming up that maybe we don't know about, yeah. just hit me up in the comments and I'll watch on here while Hannah's trying to work. Yeah, I, I do all the real work around here now. That's right. I mean, <laughs> I'm not here anyway, Hannah. Aren't you supposed to be on vacation? I am on vacation. This is, this is how I vacate. <laughs> this is how you make it. Yeah, I, I mean, where else could I have more fun than right here with QAC TV? That's true. We have a lot of fun. Yeah, we do. No, I'm actually leaving right after we're done the live show. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to jump in my car and I'm leaving. I'm out of here. And I'll be <laughs> back in two weeks. What am I supposed to do for the next two weeks without you? <laughs> we're, I mean, we're just going to turn off all the lights and just <laughs> we'll put out the, the food and water and... <laughs> And we'll leave the key to the bathroom. You'll be fine. Oh, okay, cool. Thanks. I mean, it's, it's, it's a learning process. By the time I get back, I expect you will know everything about TV. Yeah? Yeah. All right. Well, you'll be disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> ah, well. <laughs> so this week was pretty cool. We just had Halloween. Yeah. Did you have fun? I actually had a lot of fun. I had friends come over. We made a bonfire. And my mom gave us this packet to, like, throw in the bonfire that changed the fire colors. Yeah. It, like popped and made a huge noise and like <laughs> but the fire turned green so Did it work? yeah it turned green it was pretty green. cool that's yeah. so cool hey amanda Leader. <laughs> she said hi oh hi mandy yay mandy that's really cool. I actually, I tried to do that for a movie once where I did the, the color fire and didn't, or the color fire and it was supposed to be blue. It didn't work. Really? Yeah, I was very disappointed. Yeah, because it, it looked really cool. That's neat. We like, we were inside the house when it happened and like my friend turned around and went, the fire's green. And we were all like, <laughs> wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. So you handed out candy? Yes. Full size bars or fun size? Fun size. They're kids. They don't need anything else. <laughs> Are you kidding? Yeah, right. We all need full size bars. That's true. Well, the kids got a little surprised when they walked back down our driveway because my little brother and his friends were like waiting behind the cars to jump out and scare people. Did they get them? Yes. It was great. That's they were cool. so funny. I just watched Stranger Things. <laughs> That's all I did. I watched like two episodes of the first season. <gasps> did you like it? Yes. I knew it. I knew it. I haven't I watched like anything it. else yet. It's all right. You, you'll, you'll love the show. We'll, we'll have to do a review or something when you're finally done. <laughs> right. I've been trying to get her to watch Stranger Things for weeks since she hasn't done it. Okay. But we have a show to get to. That's true. And I don't know if you guys know it, but it's actually kind of nasty outside today. It is. And we have someone to tell you all about it. Go do that. It's too rainy. My sentiments so exactly. Yeah, well, you know, who wouldn't be sad? That's true. She's standing out in the rain. <laughs> and no jacket. Come on, Dad. Where are you on that one? That's true. Because at least he gave her the umbrella. <laughs> even it's even too cold for that. She yeah, it's true else. that. Yeah, she needs some. Come on. Okay, parents, dress your kids according That's, to the yeah, weather. Yeah, according to the weather. If you don't know what the weather's going to be like, it's okay. That's why we have Goldilocks. That's true. <laughs> so the weather was kind of nasty. Yep. And speaking of nasty. Did you hear about the Chesapeake Cup? I did. Yeah. So the Chesapeake Cup, which is played by Queen Anne's County High School and Kent Island High School. It's their football game. It's their big rivalry that happened Friday. And we have a video. All right. And uh, it, didn't, it didn't go according to plan for Queen Anne's County High School. They actually lost 48 to 0, which oh is sad. Gosh. But at the same time, congratulations. And that's good for Kent Island High School. So they can't always win. Obviously, they wish it was a better game, but there you get to see Ken Island holding up the trophy. Hopefully, everyone still had fun and everyone had a good time, and there's always next year. Ah, oh, our motto there at Easton High School. Yeah, Easton. <laughs> there's always next year. Yeah, don't feel bad, Queen Anne's <laughs> County. Easton High School never did it right. <laughs> we never win, <laughs> ever. So speaking of football also, to lighten up the mood, uh, there's really cool football going on right here in Centerville this weekend. And it's by someone much younger. And it's actually going to be a group from UQA, which is headed by uh, one of the board members, Brian Aiken, who sent us a message. And it came a little bit later than what we're, than we're allowed to to go out and do a shoot. So we wanted to make sure we talked about it. But they're having the Turkey Bowl games. Oh, that sounds like fun. Yeah, it should be really cute. So all the kids will be out at the Route 18 Park, and they're playing all weekend. And it'll be uh, the 11th and the 12th. And on the 12th, uh, whoever wins actually has a chance to go to a championship game. Oh, cool. 
cool. And we told them that if they make it to the championship game, let us know. We'll come out and we'll definitely do a story on that. Yeah, that'd be fun to go see them. Yeah, we're, we're going to go out there and we're going to get Hannah in full pads. No, we're not. Why not? Because <laughs> that'd be bad. <laughs> that'd be worse than the uh, Ken Allen Queen Anne's game. <laughs> <laughs> Hannah, MVP of the Turkey Bowl games. <laughs> so what else we got, Hannah? Well, of course, we've got Thor. His new movie just came out, so I'm super excited to see that. And then, take it away, Thor. Happy bathtub party day. Okay, wait. This is not a thing. How is this a thing? Where do you find these? Oh. Happy bathtub party day. <laughs> Was that a rubber ducky? Yeah. <laughs> Was that your rubber ducky? Yeah. I love you, rubber duckies. Uh, cool. Did you see the video on Instagram that they like opened up a drawbridge part way mm -hmm. and they took like a dump truck and dumped rubber duckies into this river? <laughs> no. There were so many rubber duckies in the river. That's pretty cool. Where'd that happen at? I have no idea. That's cool. We should do that. <laughs> QAC TV Thor rubber duck day. All right. We'll duck all duck. We'll, <laughs> we'll dump all the ducks we have into a pond or something. All right. We'll make a pond out back. Yeah, Steve Wilson. See if you can make that happen. <laughs> so real quick, Mandy just dropped a message in. Don't forget to tell everyone. I won't, Mandy. I'm going to do it right now. That this weekend, Friday and Saturday, is Edwards' annual open house. Oh, that's fun. Yeah, so go see Mandy. Did you know Mandy works at Edwards also? Yes. Yeah. I remember because she did the nip, the whip and the nae nae costume right. for Edwards. There you go. Yep. And there's also a Veterans Day celebration this Saturday at the courthouse with music, guest speakers, and according to Mandy, it's going to be a very nice event. <laughs> Sounds like fun. <laughs> cool. So thanks, Mandy, for dropping those two events for us. Hopefully, everyone can go out this weekend and have fun at those things. Yeah. So Thor, sorry, we digress, but Thor, you're going to go see it, right? Definitely, yep. Are you guys going together? Yeah, he finally convinced me to go see it with him. What did, what did he have to do to finally get you to agree? We're going to get our nails done. Nails done. <laughs> I like getting my nails done. As guardian nails. Is he going to get his done? Hopefully. Yeah. French tip. <laughs> French tip. Hair did for Thor. He's going to come back with a bun. <laughs> French tip. A man bun. Sure. No thanks. No? No. That's not a thing anymore? Is no. that out? It was never a thing in my world. <laughs> <laughs> it was never. Sorry, Ted. The man bun's out before you could even grow back your hair to do it. Sorry, Ted. <laughs> And one last thing, right? Yep. What we got? We have the All-American Smokeout. Ah, that's right. I actually got to go to the no matter what event that uh, Queens County held about the opioids and addiction. And while I was there, I got to meet a very lovely lady from the Queens County Health Department. And she had a lot to say about the smokeout. So kick the hearth, Theodore. So we met the Queen Anne's County Health Department table. I got a cool shirt, so you've already missed out on that if you're not here. But what kind of programs are you guys offering? We offer several programs, but um, personally I work in the Cigarette Restitution Fund Program mm -hmm. and the SINAR Initiative Program. And what that is, the Cigarette Restitution Fund Program help people, the citizens in Queen Anne's County, um, help quit smoking. We offer free patches, nicotine replacement therapy, counseling. We go out into the community and um, offer um, awareness information. Um, we offer many grants for community organizations to do tobacco prevention activities in the county. And for the SINAR initiative, that's a grant we receive where we go into the um, tobacco retailers and make sure that they're um, complying with the law and not selling tobacco products to underage youth. And the sheriff department, they also work with us, collaborate with us to make sure that they're doing what they're supposed to do and they go in and do like compliance checks. Um, we have non-governmental organizations that do that as well and go out and give information to the tobacco retailers to make sure they know the laws. And we send them information, just keep them updated on the new laws and the laws that's going on about tobacco use and underage tobacco sales. It's good. Sounds like you're busy. Yes, very, very busy. But you still have time for trivia night. Yes, we do. Yes, trivia night. That's November the 16th. It's the um, Great American Smoke. Out. It's always the third Thursday in November, and that's where most Americans quit smoking for the first time and go on to live smoke-free lifestyles. So it's a fun event for the family, anybody come on out. And then Citizens Against Smoking Tobacco, they also have a drawing where they can win a 32-inch um, TV um, there at the event. So we're going to have fun, food, it's a free event. That sounds amazing. Yes. 
Excellent. So like, take part in the Great American Smokeout. Yeah. Yeah. Seems really cool. Did yeah. you know that if you smoke a pack a day, it equals to two, $2,800 a year that you're spending on cigarettes? Hannah, that's like $2,800 more than we pay you. Yeah. That's crazy. You don't smoke, do you? No. No, okay, me either. No. But there's never a better time to quit than around the Great American Smokeout because there's all types of programs and there's all types of help that you can get. So just go to the Queens County Health Department website and they have all types of ways that can help you to quit smoking and get your life back on track where you're making an extra $2,860 a year. Yeah, that's like... You could add it all up and go on like a cool vacation or something. <laughs> like, like I'm doing right now. Yeah, like doing. Uh, yeah. yeah, so that's cool. So that's our live show. Yep. So thanks for uh, watching. We see that uh, John Queen checked in. John Queen gave us the googly eyes looking at the screen. So John Queen, thanks for watching. <laughs> we always appreciate all your comments that you can leave. We appreciate any help, any feedback, uh, likes, shares, yep. all we that. We love hearing from you guys. Yeah. And I think that's it for today, right? right? Thanks for watching and you can still comment after we're done. See you later. Sailors. <laughs>